Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Ruby on Rails. Today we are going to learn how to add the Tailwind CSS into your running project. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here you can see that we have already implemented the Tailwind CSS. How we have done this, we are going to learn in this video. Let's dive into the code level directly. So first of all, you have to go with this one. Let me share. Okay, for the existing rail app, you have to go with bundle add tailwind CSS rails. After that, bin rails tailwind CSS install. Okay, then verify the configuration in the app tailwind application tailwind CSS include the default tailwind imports. So already it creates the files with the necessary configurations. You know, you don't need to do anything. Then you have to add any tailwind CSS classes into your layouts file, application HTML or any anywhere. Okay, so just add it. And one thing that I have done that make sure you have to run build rails tailwind CSS install. Okay, after doing this, it automatically get all the tailwind CSS files and it will show over there. Okay, so these are the steps that you have to follow and it out any query in that do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day and don't forget to like share and comment on my video. Have a nice day.